Hi, welcome to my video. Today, I want to show you that I can take the Intel Wi-Fi Flink 5300 wireless card from this Dell Studio 15 and use it on the old Dell Inspiron 6400. Here is the Intel Wi-Fi Flink 5300 wireless card. I will take it out. As you notice, this Intel Wi-Fi Flink 5300 wireless card it has three antenna representing three color, white, gray, and black. Now I will put this card into the Dell Inspiron 6400. Under the keyboard, here is the wireless card for the Dell Inspiron 6400. My Inspiron 6400 use wireless card model. Dell Wireless 1390. It has only two antenna. When I compare the two wireless cards side by side, the Intel Wi-Fi 5300 is only half the size of the Dell Wireless 1390. After I put in the Intel Wi-Fi Blink 5300, I connect the black antenna for the black triangle. I connect the white antenna for the gray triangle. This Intel Wi-Fi Link 5300 is half the size of the original card, so there is a gap between here and here. Therefore, there is nothing to hold down this wireless card. However, there is another way to hold down this wireless card. Since this wireless card is under the keyboard, I can put something in between. When I put the keyboard in, the keyboard will press this wireless card down and hold it in place. I put a little piece of paper folded right here to hold down the wireless card. Now I will put back everything together and turn on my computer. I want to show you that it worked perfectly. Now I will show you the software. The reason is say no support Wi-Fi adapter available in the system because I am using Windows Auto Configuration Wireless. I am not using the Intel software at all. But these are the options if you were to use the Intel software. The Intel Wi-Fi Link 5300 wireless card works perfectly on my Dell Inspiron 6400. Also, the Intel Wi-Fi Link 5300 wireless card has three antenna. I use only two, and it works fine. Thank you for watching my video.